Look at that beautiful design. <laughs> I did some work off camera, as you guys probably told. And uh, this is the stuff that I did. I added a pattern to the floor, so it looks less bland. It's actually uh, from my old texture pack. I haven't bothered to uh, download and put on this computer yet. Uh, but basically where you see these little things coming across, that went all the way. So they mo looked more like planks, other than just a strip of wood. Uh, and I, I liked that texture a lot better. And I needed to, uh, I need to update that pack yet. I'm going to be working at that for a while, but... Uh, overall, uh, this is kind of the, the idea that I had for the floor here. This goes straight down the center. And then I believe uh, this does not exactly meet center. Slightly off, but whatever. This is the center of the tower right here, this thing. Uh, very center of the central tower. Um, I started working on rising up some of these walls. I got to about there and ran out of resources. I also moved the workers' hut a bit and have my little AFK spot there. So yeah, welcome back, everyone. Uh, whatever stuff happened, did this off camera. This is all half slabs as well, just to conserve resources. Uh, I did actually, as you guys seem to get an enchantment table, I didn't to enchant my boots yet, so let's go do that. Uh, I'm actually running a bit low on beef, so we're probably going to have to make some sort of animal farm, or f farm in general, because I think I actually still have some carrots laying around, so I could use those. Uh, but yeah, I got an enchantment table up, let's uh, enchant these uh, just like a level 1, don't need anything too crazy. Uh, so yeah, made a little bedroom here. Uh, this is just a temporary bedroom. We'll move it eventually, but this is just intentional or uh, intended to be like a lookout post. Uh, but right now it's a bedroom. Uh, I probably need to go through and get rid of all those wooden planks around there, around the outside. It's probably a thing that I need to be doing. I'll probably do that. I'm, uh, I'm actually going to quickly do that and I'll get back to you guys in a minute. Okay. Death. Okay, we're not dealing with that. I heard some mobs, and I thought I'd investigate. Not a good idea. Okay, whatever. So we're almost done. We're gonna leave that, because that's my like little standing spot that I stand on to look at my amazing build <laughs> uh, every once in a while, but yeah. So, for those of you guys who watch my TF2 content, you guys are probably wondering where the hell it is, because I'm posting Minecraft a lot more frequently on this channel, and I'm actually... Highly debating on starting up a new channel just for my TF2 gameplays because um, I kind of want to upload daily on both channels, uh, two videos a day, and I'm still thinking of a name for it, kind of throwing some around, um, but it'll most likely just be doing the commentary thing as well as some random stuff. Uh, but I'm, I'm debating on doing that because no one on this channel really watches. I TF2 content that often, and I think I should switch it over just to uh, have a different channel for that so I'm not posting too frequently if you guys don't like Minecraft content, if you don't like TF2 content. Uh, so I think I'm going to split those, uh, kind of like split my channel up. Uh, so yeah, this is going to be the Minecraft channel right here. Not migrating anything off of this one. Probably mark all my TF2 videos unlisted. I'll probably do like a little update video. Uh, and stuff on that, but nothing too major. Um, I think I've seen a cave underneath this hill, but I think I've already explored it, so we can get rid of this wooden plank. So yeah, uh, that's my plan there, but whatever. Guys probably don't care, whatever, gosh. Uh, but yeah, yeah, this project is going to take a long time. Because building up these walls, uh, just from there to there, was eight piles of cobblestone. Uh, actually, no, I think it was about six. And I was also doing some other things with it. But still, it was a lot of stone bricks that I'm using. 
consistently. So I need to begin gathering a lot more resources, uh, mining a lot more and what's not. I am working on a, a better mine shaft, digging in my tunnels 3x3 three three instead of the 1x2 uh, that I've been doing. Let's actually t use the quick drop down here. I kind of widened up this area right here a bit. Uh, there's slime around here. A bunch of guys around here. I may have missed a cave. Interesting, but um, yeah, it's gonna be quite interesting. Now, another thing I have to do is uh, let's actually get up this ladder. Now, another big part of this project is the second floor. <laughs> now, second floor is exactly the size, but it's up there, right along where the wall is, and it's going to be really annoying to build, and I'm probably going to begin working on that this episode, uh, at least getting an outline. I'm going to make it a half slab so I don't have to light it up, uh, like just normal half slabs, probably about three blocks down there, because I have to make it level with the top of that door. So it'll probably be going along right there. Right along there. Uh, and I have to build the entire wall up to that height. It's going to be actually quite annoying. And I may add a pattern to the top of it as well. But I'm going to begin working on the outline for it. Because that's a pretty big part of it. And uh, I'm going to do some work on that. Probably won't be doing a time lapse or anything. I need to do it kind of off camera. If I do, do it. Actually, hmm. No, no time lapse, no time lapse, no time lapse. So I'm going to do some work off camera. I'll see you guys in a few minutes. Look at that. So I'll take a look at that from the ground level here. Yup. Take your quick drop down there. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Looks so silly. Having an octagon floating in the air like that. Uh, I cannot get the calculations on this side right, so I just kind of left it. But otherwise, I got everything about right, because I don't have any... Uh, the tower laid out on this side yet. Oh yeah, that's that. That's the size of the second floor. And I'm not sure what'll be up there. God damn it, Windows. Sorry about that. I don't have Windows 8 activated yet. <laughs> I've had this computer for months. <sighs> I'm just too lazy to activate it. Whatever. Doesn't bother me too often. That's the first time it's ever interrupted a recording session for me. Uh, but yeah, look at that. Look at all of that. Uh, I just need to fill that in now. Um, probably need to leave a space for the center tower, which I'm yet to lay out. Probably just gonna leave it like that for a while, just so we know where to stop building the walls. Because this ends up right at the top of the walls. Like the top of the door right there is where it starts. So, yeah. And if you guys are wondering what the hell this thing is and why the doors aren't so big, uh, someone on the server is wondering why the doors were so massive. It's actually based off of Mario Brothers Castle, uh, the newer versions, the newer editions. Uh, this is similar to the entrance of it. I'm modifying it a bit based on some sketches, but otherwise this is basically it. Uh, so yeah, that's, that's that. I do not have any pictures of it though, sadly. Let's actually go up and sleep in the bed. That's not very convenient to have the bed on top of a tower, but whatever. I don't care. Doesn't look like I care because I don't care. Do friggin' just whatever. Uh, so yeah, I need to start filling that in. I think I only used like three stacks of slabs out of the 12 that I had available to me. And I am inside of a block. <laughs> oh, that's actually quite funny. Okay, well, let's actually, uh, I need to begin filling it in. I'm gonna see how much I can get filled in and I'll, I'll keep you guys reported. <laughs> I don't think you guys realize how much effort went into this, man. Just freaking filled it all in. Had to harvest a bunch of wood. Even though I have a bunch of... Well, not really a bunch. Some spare stuff. I had to do darker outline. This is where the central tower is going to be. It's fairly wide, but... The thing is, it's going to be very base. If it's going to be very wide, then it's going to uh, drop off every so often. Until it's just a spire. Uh, so, yeah, that's the size of the central tower base. Right there, and we'll have some support pillars going down. I don't think we need this here anymore. Uh, but yay. 
Progress has been made. Finally built that roof. I actually made an access hatch to it. Oh, let's not sprint because I'm out of food again. <laughs> Entirely out. I went through and I have a couple carrots left, but that's it. Uh, in here, I made an access hatch to the roof. Roof access, I suppose. A little bit more of a better name, I guess. That's that right there. And there's this. I can actually fall from here and not die, but I only have like a half a heart left. And that's why I've been running out of food because I keep falling off of this. Having to heal up. But that's that. It goes all the way around. It's a fairly perfect circle. I wouldn't say perfect, but it's it's a good circle. I went through and did the calculations for it. It's a good circle. Um, but yeah. Because I just wanted to uh, have a good, good circle. So yeah. That's the circle. Let's actually jump back down here. I think my armor helps as well with uh, the preventing a little bit of damage. But yeah, what's that? It's the ring through the trapezoid. Uh, not trapezoid, hexagon. Two trapezoids, whatever. <laughs> oh yeah, that's that. Uh, I probably need to be working on the, uh, the tower itself. Eventually, once we get these walls up to that height. And then we need to begin working on the tower. At that point, this will just be a giant room. <laughs> so, yeah. I'll keep you guys posted on any other progress that I make. Oh, God. Save me. Oh. It's a chicken jockey. Oh, God. I'm stuck. Death becoming. I was watching a video and the hunting mobs and these little speed hackers come around. You're, you're dead, son. You're dead. <laughs> That was actually quite hilarious, two of them. <laughs> this is the most tedious thing I've done in a while. Is I'm moving this entire floor a half block down. I already went through and broke. Or not broke, but uh, placed all these, and these are normal blocks. So I'm getting quite a bit of wood back. I put it away because I did a bit of mob killing recently, but... Um... Yeah, I have to lower this entire floor by half a block. It's not fun. Not very fun at all. It's really annoying. And, uh, yeah, that's just so I don't have the torches all over the ground. I'm adding these torches right here for mood lighting. Uh, and to keep the walls lit up and stuff. So, I, I'm not sure if I've shown you guys, but I filled that in and stuff. So, yeah. I'm still working on this. I'll keep you guys up to date as I have been with this project so far. Uh, there's creepers everywhere, holy crap. Uh, I count like five creepers just in this area. It's freaking insane. So yeah, give you guys posted. Hey, this little bastard scared the hell out of me. I thought it was a creeper. God, just to die. Oh my god, not done. I still have this little portion here, but... Uh, I think I'm going to save that for a while. Uh, so this this bit right here is my worker's slab. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I set up a furnace right here to smelt crap. It's 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 fairly useful, I guess. I used it. I made the rest of the wall all to the same elevation and stuff. Uh, so we have that kind of mood glow going on there. So yeah, we have all this done pretty much. Finally flattened it out. And I was actually watching one of Etho's videos and uh, had some inspiration. In his latest video, he has like this, he's making this cave and he has all these platforms around. It. And I think instead of just having this being a flat floor, I think I'm going to have sort of a balcony system going around here with the initial entrance stairs going down the center right here. Uh, and the entrance goes up there as well as the, uh, the double helix spiral staircase coming from the very center here, which is going to be aligned to this block. Um, would be a double helix sort of stairway going around this up. A uh, very big staircase, probably begin working on that off camera between the next episodes, or probably work on it this episode. Not a lot to see. But sort of a balcony system just above those torches. Uh, just going along there, and possibly going towards the double helix system. Uh, something having some sort of balcony going around in a circle a little bit smaller than this <laughs> uh, 
Uh, that circle right there is going to go up about 10 blocks, and then it's going to go in a bunch, and then rise up the rest of the way, uh, and then stop. It'll it'll go up 10 blocks, and it'll go down, then it'll go up 20 blocks, and it'll go in a little bit more, then 30, uh, and etc. Uh, the tower is going to be an exponential growth. I'll do the math behind it, because I think I'm going to make it drop down like 10 blocks inwards every time it drops off. So that's from right here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Uh, so it'll drop off to about here on the circle. And then it'll go up 20. And then, or maybe I'll do 10, 5, no. 10, 8. Uh, what's, what's a good number after that? Like 6, 4, etc. Just kind of make it a, a gradual sort of thing. I'll have to graph it out and make sure that there's enough elevation in the world <laughs> to make the tower that tall. I kind of want it to be all the way go up to the sky limit because we're going to have a roof like that on the very top as well. Made this close on me. A little bit glitchy, but it works and I just walk out. So I walk in from any direction, basically. In my little AFK room. Just so I don't accidentally look at an Enderman. A lot of Endermen around here, though. Me a little bit of a problem, but yeah. So I raised up the rest of the walls and everything. So, uh, it's that. Uh, I'm probably going to be working the dual helix stair system as well as rising the rest of the wall up two or three blocks so we can build the, uh, the balconies. So I'll, I'll keep you guys posted. So I worked on the first helix, the first portion of the first helix. Uh, the other portion is over here. I used to be over here. Probably won't be doing uh, this helix until um, I get this worker shock moved. Probably within the next episode or so. Uh, but yeah, this is the first portion of the first helix. It comes up here and then it flattens out here. Because coming up with the stair design that flattens it out to this shape here is really hard. <laughs> So I just kind of made like a little bit of a balcony. We may attach something this way. Or something. And then it goes up here. So yeah. We're probably actually. Hmm. I should probably actually raise this up. Right here. So yeah. I miss every block of place. Uh, so it starts going up again here. So this balcony is this shape. Basically a triangle. So you come up here. Probably some sort of bridge going over to the other layer of balcony over there. Because uh, as you guys know, I was going to work on adding a, a walkway around. And uh, it'll probably end up, end off right there. And it'll be like a little bit of a spiral staircase or something over there. And so yeah, that's the design for the stairs right there. And it, excuse me, it follows the curve of the thing, of the circle. So I should be able to just walk along here while looking up and be just fine. As I told you guys. And then go up here and then I'll fall. Because I haven't done it the rest yet. But you guys get the point. Uh, so yeah. That's that. Pretty much finishes that off. I'm probably going to have to do something else here. I may center this platform. So it starts going up the center here. We'll see. Uh, I'll do some stuff off camera, and I'll see you guys next time.